Hey everybody, Chris from Prepared Mind 101. I'm reshooting this intro because now the light has made itself a lot more amenable to my video recording. So today we're going to be doing the review and checking out the One Wind 12 Foot Tempest Hammock that I recently got. I've set it up a couple times. My son set it up, taking a nice good nap in it. And this thing has a lot to offer because it's an all-in-one inclusive system. It's got the suspension, it's got the bug net, it's got really good material. And I don't have to carry a bunch of extra stuff. I don't have to carry extra carabiners or extra long straps because the way this thing is set up is just so freaking easy that it's just a no-brainer. It's a no-brainer if you're going to get a quality hammock. Um, to have everything in one in one setup so if you want to know more about this and and see what it looks like then don't go away So like I pointed out in my live uh, first impressions video, setup is very easy. Uh, on the end of each hammock you've got this buckle. They come with two sets of with a set of straps so you just throw the strap around the tree and just feed that through. Back over like such. And then go ahead and set that up here on the other side. Getting a look at this uh, hexagonal ripstop nylon that this stuff is made out of. So it's got these parts right here, which I didn't see listed anywhere for like what they're actually for but you know just tinkering around with it it seems like you can use them obviously without the bug net but say you wanted to put them up to you know break a little bit of the wind or block the sun or something like that I can put one side of it up and I've still got enough to lay here comfortably. Hey, where'd you go? But yeah, this is some uh, this is some good stuff right here. This uh, ridge, this adjustable ridge line. I forget what this stuff is called. I used to have a bunch of it, like back in the day, like twenty. 14 2015 ish prepare my 101 
It's, um, dang, what is this stuff called? It's like, it's like this crazy strong stuff. It's like 1,500 pound test. It's like eight times like a steel cable of the same diameter. Ugh. I'll, I'm sure I'll find it and put it on the screen or something. But it's adjustable according to the website. So you can pull it in on both ends and adjust the length a bit, which adjusts the way you hang. But, I mean, it's pretty much perfect as it is right now, as far as I can tell. So I kind of did what uh, a guy did in the other video, in another video, kind of pulled this down to the wrong side. But the stuff sack is double ended. And then if you got it on the other side, the way it's supposed to be, loosen this up here. Then you can stuff the whole bug net in there and keep it up out of the way until you want to put it back up. So let me go ahead and put that back up. This is a great hammock. I'm loving this thing. So I do have a standalone, I think I have two of them from other companies, like a standalone bug net that goes around hammocks if you don't have a bug net. But obviously this is much simpler and it's all built into it. And if you don't want to use the bug net, you can just unzip it like I just did. So it's taken up a lot less room in the pack. And it does come with two, maybe that's what these things are actually for. You got, you, it does come with the two like guy lines and stakes. If, you know, some people like to stake it out so it doesn't swing as much. So that would be my, my sense. So let's check that out. Okay, the two stakes each have uh, elastic cord. So I went ahead and staked the sides out. So I'll try this again. tell you what I have like zero trouble getting comfortable in this thing like this might be and I'm not just saying this because I'm reviewing it I'm saying it because it's true like this might be the easiest nicest most comfortable hammock I've had Yeah, it's not a $20 Walmart hammock, but the quality of it, the design of it, and most importantly, the comfort of it. 
Now I've got a little got a little ring here on my ridge line. So if I want to hang my handy new light I got the other day. Something like that. I mean, I, I would... Yeah, I would... I, I could definitely sleep in this. I'd sleep really, really good. I mean, I've taken a nap in it. <laughs> but it's been pretty hot out here, too. I have no problem whatsoever getting at that right angle. So I'm you know, laying pretty flat, just enough enough angle on my head that, you know, I could go to sleep rather easily right now. And I've got this nice barrier because the trees are always lobbing seeds at me. So what I'll do is I'll have my assistant uh, run through the specs with you real quick so you get all the uh, information that you actually need nice and clearly put better than I usually do if I'm just going off the cuff. The One Wind 12-foot zipper hammock is a modular, bug net camping hammock that features an elongated symmetrical gathered end design. This allows you to lay comfortably in any direction. The hammock body is built with a single layer of durable nylon fabric with unique hexagonal rips top that maximizes stretch to maximize your ability to lay flat. Sleeping comfortably in a hammock is often equated with being able to lie flat at night, instead of sleeping in a curved position like a banana. The size of the hammock is 12 feet by 68 inches. The total weight including the tree straps, cinch buckles, ridgeline, and sack is 2.4 pounds. The hammock bed and bug net itself weighs in at 1.5 pounds. The hammock bed material is 2.1 ounces, 70 denier hexagon ripstop nylon fabric. The bug net material is a polyester mesh. The ridgeline material is listed on the website as UHMWPE whatever that is. There is another name, but we can't remember it. The hammock comes with two 12-foot long tree straps, two shock cords, and two aluminum tent stakes. This hammock can be found on Amazon Prime for $74.90 at the time of this video being made. This goes without saying, but chicks dig hammocks. Just make sure you let us use one with a bug net. We do not generally dig bugs. I mean, if I can figure it out the first time, that means about anyone else can too. that up so that we don't lose it. And we're going to do the rest of the strap. I'll get the rest of my strap and stuff them in the side. Now I have the whole setup right here. Hammock and suspension. 
you know, pound and a half. Didn't even have to use any like carabiners or anything like that. It was, you know, a 12 foot hammock with those straps. That's seriously cutting down on my carry weight. If I want to carry a hammock, because I mean, you see my other one, you know, my hang around and chill hammock. I mean, that's a lot more stuff, but this, everything I need is right there. You know, minus a tarp, which, you know, we'll be looking at that next. But yeah, this is like for the size weight and what it offers and the quality that I can see, um, this, this is probably the best one I've had yet. So really glad that I uh, found this company. Good stuff. Now pulling these pointy devil stakes out of the ground, that's a different story. So, luckily, Suckers are sharp. Luckily, got just enough of a hook right there that I could take the lanyard on my ever present Benchmade Claymore and use that to pull the stakes out without, you know, ripping my hands to shreds. But I don't usually stake out the sides of a hammock, so I don't even know if, I'm, honestly, this, uh, the stretchy cord has more value to me for using or attaching things like ferro rods to knife sheaths and stuff like that. But, hmm, yeah, I would, I, I almost never stake it out, so I don't see why I absolutely need it. But, you know, you have that option if that's something that you want. So, here you go, folks. That is the Tempest 12 foot hammock by One Wind. Really liking it good stuff uh, the next camping trip I'll be uh, definitely using it I'll be using it just for break time nap <laughs> if it's if it's a nice enough day if it's not too humid when I'm out here because usually I'm out here at least half the day either testing things off camera or just you know shooting videos or something like that but I love that it's all everything that I need in that one little bit. Now, I don't have to carry a bunch of extra stuff like I was doing. So, yeah, I expect to probably see a lot more One Wind stuff on this channel because they have a lot of things that I'm interested in, uh, especially those those big uh, those tarps that you put them out over the hammock and then you can fold the flats in and it's almost like having a tent. Uh, really cool, really cool. And if we're going to be out here, you know, in the colder months, probably to start looking at some of that under quilt type stuff as well. But yeah, if, you know, when it comes to the hammocks and stuff like that, it pays to get quality. You can get really expensive. You can get really cheap. This is right in the range where, in my opinion, if I'm not mistaken, it was in the 70 ish range. But it's your hammock, it's your bug net, it's your suspension, and you don't need anything else. So, that right there. Pretty cool. All right, Chris from Prepared Mind 101, thanks for watching. Be sure to click like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section below. Um, when you get a heart, it means I read your comment. Uh, I like hearing your feedback, I like getting your questions, and it helps the algorithm. Memberships to the channel are on the front page. We got um, here in the first week of August, we'll be doing the first giveaway for the members. And it's been upgraded. I was going to push it back a month. But instead, we're going to make the first giveaway month something special. And, that's going to, and this particular one, it's going to include everybody, not just the giveaway tier. And that is going to be for that work tough gear famine. So that is an outstanding, stellar, awesome knife. But in the meantime, check out uh, One Wind's website. Check out everything that they got on there. And if you use my link below, that'll help support the channel. Plus, you get a coupon code 
Uh, coupon code PM101 knocks 5% off your order. All right, see you next time.